Oh, yes. <laughs> the no one can sue without a writ? Yes. <laughs> Now, I was wanting to petition some courts, and um, your thought was, well, we just won't let them use the court system. <laughs> we won't let them use the Washington State court system. <laughs> and you say you have no idea what's in the actual ingredients of the pills that you've been taking. Oh, <laughs> now let's say you're a dog. <laughs> And your thought was, well, I have to take a pill every month so as to make it look like I'm normal when I'm not. Poop! <laughs> now, I'm going to want to know the prescriptions of those that are judges that said, well, I'm just going to sit here and listen and kind of medicate myself. And then, <laughs> how many pharmaceuticals have been tested <laughs> to see the actual effect of any technology on what they do to the human mind or body? Poop! <laughs> Now, usually, yes, <coughs> I would think, yeah, that a pharmaceutical company has never been obligated to prove that the pharmaceutical that's being manufactured is in any way influenced by the use of sonar, yes, radio signals, yeah, <laughs> electricity, ooh, <laughs> spectrum, ooh, any of the broadbands, the Wi Fi, the 3G, 4G, or 5G, pooch them. But let's say you got approved an anti-anxiety medication that you tested for side effects. Yes. But you never ever were obligated to test for the actual effect of any sort of broadband on the medication itself. Yeah. Now some of these ingredients of pharmaceutical companies, yeah, they're very scientific. I mean, when you think about the formulas necessary to manufacture any sort of antipsychotic yeah, or any psychotropic pooch, or any sort of erectile dysfunction medication, yes, because I don't think the FDA had ever thought about the effect of technology on actual medications. Oh, now usually you do a blind study yes 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 and you find out well you got diarrhea or heart palpitations or it puts you in a coma <laughs> but those were all medical reasons for the side effects there wasn't a pharmaceutical company in the United States that ever had to test for the effect yes of technology on their medication oh <laughs> now let's say I wanted to sue some pharmaceutical companies or some pharmacies that decided to design their own medications yes and I said well <laughs> it looks like 3g yes when used in cooperation with uh, medication that causes any anxiety yes <laughs> actually does affect the thoughts of those that take it and it's not the medic <laughs> Now, there could be some billion-dollar lawsuits today, and, you know, I can't sue without a writ. So get me right now. Because I don't think that the actual government of the United States of America has ever considered that the substances in pharmaceuticals can be attached to the technology used in cell phones. That's right. The technology used in televisions. <laughs> Now, when we go through the actual prescriptions for the last 20 years, I'm going to want to know. Oh, she is! <laughs>